Hey guys, welcome to the channel. Today in this video, I'm going to be running through how to run Google Ads in 2024 and even beyond. So we're going to cover everything that you need to learn how to run Google Ads. And specifically for this video, we're going to be focusing on YouTube ads. So I'm going to show you how to run ads on YouTube. Of course, if you're watching videos on YouTube, you're going to see ads pop up on your screen. Some are display ads, some are ads you can skip after playing for some time so i'm going to show you how to run those ads and everything that you need to put in place so that you can run a successful campaign so make sure you follow through this tutorial step by step and don't skip anything so just before we dive into it if you are new to this channel please subscribe to the channel give this video a thumbs up and if you are finding this video valuable please write in the comments google ads all right so without making so much ado i'm going to dive into my dashboard and i'm going to show you guys exactly how to set up youtube ads campaign using google ads if you don't already have a google account all you just need to do is to type ads.google.com on google and then you should come on this screen and you're going to set up your account so just click on login and log into your account or follow the simple prompt and create an account it is very easy i'm not going to dive into that i want to dive into the nitty-gritty of how to set up your campaign so just follow the simple prompt and create an account add your payment method and all of that so let's dive into the main stuff okay i'm going to use my own ad account to show you guys how to set up a campaign all right so this is what your dashboard is going to look like if you have finished setting up your ads account so what i'm going to do is to click on create campaign and then we're going to select campaigns it's going to ask you what is your campaign objective so you have different objectives so i'm going to explain them a little bit now you have sales that is if you want to drive sales to your website or your product then if you want to collect leads or if you want website traffic if you want to promote your apps if you want to create some kind of um, awareness or a local store so for this tutorial, we're going to use create a campaign without a ghost guidance. All right. So just select that. This is where you're not going to select different types of ads. So like I said, for this video, we're going to be focusing on video ads. So we want to run ads on YouTube. Okay. Now I'm going to select video and then you have options to choose whether you want video views, whether you want efficient reach, whether you want target frequency, non-skippable reach, or you want to drive conversions. You also have um ad sequence and audio all right so these are different um uh, stuff so if you want to get more conversions with your video ads then you're going to select this one okay if it's a short video and you don't want people to skip it it has to be 15 seconds then if you want video views so probably you have a video on your channel and you want people to watch that video or you, your ad is going to be a long ad and you want people to watch that video so you can select the video views but for the kind of ad i want to run now i want to run um ads using shorts video so i'm going to click on non-skippable because i want people to you know just watch the entire ad and then you know since it's not going to be long so they can just watch the entire stuff so i'm going to click non-skippable reach and then i'm going to click continue so here i'm going to give my video a name okay the campaign so I'm going to name the campaign. Then you have bid strategy. Okay. So when you expand bid strategy, you're going to see different options. So you can see targets per CPM. It's going to be on target per CPM because of the kind of ads we are running. So there are other ones. You have massive maximum CPV, viable CPM, target CPA, maximum conversion. So it's going to be um, per thousand. So with target CPM, it's going to be cost per thousand impressions that's how this is going to work down here you have budget so you can decide to choose daily bu daily budget campaign or campaign total so if you want to run ads for like seven days or for a certain period of time you can just give it a total amount to spend but if you want to um, spend across daily so you can just select daily and for this particular one i want to select daily and i want to test this out to see what is going to work so you can choose anywhere between five dollar ten dollar fifteen dollar twenty dollar depending on your budget and what you want to achieve but for this test ad i just want to use five dollars per day okay and see how it um, works from there all right 
now you come down to where you have networks okay now i want my ads to appear on youtube okay i do not want it to appear anywhere else apart from youtube so i'm going to deselect google tv and i'm going to deselect google partners that is very important okay if not you might spend money where you do not want to spend money and you will not get the desired result so i want my you my videos to play only on youtube so the next thing to select is location so you have options to enter different locations that you want you can select all countries and territories if that is what you want you can target a particular country for me i want to target nigeria for this particular ad okay so i'm going to select nigeria so if it is us you can enter another location and select the country that you want to target so i want to target nigeria and then for language i'm going to leave it on english so you can add related videos to your ads to help the engagement all right but i don't want to do that so i'm just going to leave that then you have this additional settings it's very important you're going to expand it and under this additional settings you have devices you're going to expand that so you can be able to set your ads the way you want it so if you don't select um, specific devices to target or google is going to send your ads to computers to mobile to tablet and then to tv screens i do not want tv screens all right so i'm going to select my specific targets so and i'm going to deselect tv screens so i can allow the ads to run on computers on mobile phones tablets that's pretty fine all right but i don't want it to show on tv screens and then for operating systems all right you can leave it at all operating systems all device and all networks but you also have the options to you know edit things if you want to select particular device model maybe people who are using iphones or people who are using android and stuff like that okay that's that so i'm going to click that then you have frequency capping on that frequency capping you have cap impression frequency so you limit how many times that the ads is going to show to the same user okay so i do not want this ad to keep showing to the same person and then keep paying for that same person so i can decide to let this ad show to a particular person once per day all right once they see it once per day then they can wait for the next day to be able to see it again you also have ad schedule here is where you can schedule your ads to run from a particular time so i do not want to do that i'll just leave it to run the way it is third party measurements you have nothing to really do here just leave that then you have create your ad group so i'm just going to give this an ad group name now we'll come down to audience so for audience you can select different audience you can name this audience whatever you call it i can call it my shopify audience okay so under audience you can select the demography okay if you want female male or whatever but i just want to send it to female and male i'll just deselect the unknown and then for age i just want people from from 25 to maybe 64 then i'm going to deselect the unknown so here you have additional demography okay um parents not a parent household income so for different countries you have the option to choose household income so for example if you're targeting us you would have the option to select household income here so depending on the type of product you want to sell if you're going to be selling high ticket product so you want to maybe select top 10 percent earners all right so um if you're going to be selling a low ticket so you can leave it open or lower than 50 percent so but for nigeria they don't have this um additional demography so i cannot target that so i'll just leave that and then under here you have interests and detailed demography so here you can actually add what people are looking for maybe people who are looking for advertising and marketing sales marketing jobs stuff like that but i just want to leave it open okay um where i'm going to be making um selecting my audience because i want people who are actively searching for particular terms okay particular keywords so i'm not going to do so much with the interest and um, demography here so for data just leave the data as it is 
and for audience just leave it as it is now this is where we're going to be making um selecting what exactly how people are going to find our videos so i'm going to add some keywords i want people who are entering certain keywords to find my video all right so what you're going to simply do is to enter the keywords that are relevant to your ads or to the video you're going to be running ads to so once you're done with that you're going to just okay remove that then it shows that you have keywords here okay now i do not want to go into topics or placements i just if i want to um, go further i can add some topics about the video ads or something but I think the keyword is enough already. Now I'm going to show you something also on placement. Placement, you can decide to place your ads on particular YouTube channels or on particular videos. Okay. But I do not want to do that. I just want my video to my video ads to appear when people are searching certain keywords which I've already entered. So once I'm done with that. Now you're going to put your YouTube video here. Okay. So I'm just going to grab the link of my YouTube video and I'm going to place it here. I'm going to paste my video link here and then I can put my website. First of all, change this to HTTPS. Then I'm going to select this call to action and select what my call to action would be. I'm going to select learn more. You can see as I'm doing whatever I'm doing here, it's actually showing on the ads here. Now I'm going to put the long headline and then write some description. Once I'm done with that, so I'm just going to give this ad a name just to track it. Okay. And I'm going to also put the bidding here. So my bidding can be 0 0.02. And once I'm done with all of this so i'm going to click create campaign and our campaign is ready to go then we will not have to wait for approval so once it's approved you can see the campaign run on your dashboard so this is a simple step by step on how to create a youtube ads using the google ads platform i hope you guys got some value from this video make sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed Give this video a thumbs up if you find it valuable. Remember not to comment Google Ads in the comment section. And when I come your way next time, keep winning. Thank you for watching and God bless you. Bye.